Hey everybody, welcome back to Shaving with Rip. Today, I'll be uh, doing a face shave. Um, I have a few days worth of fuzz on the face. So, um, as you can see, I survived my last uh, head shave. I didn't bleed out, so I'm still around. Thank God. Um, so, I will be using, today for my face shave, I'll be using um, a couple new products. Uh, one is a soap that I received, I received yesterday. Uh, which is um, I'll show it to you here um, it is a, a asylum shave uh, asylum shave works uh, the flying mango shaving soap right there it is in collaboration with Saponificio uh, Veracino it's uh, the flying mango right there you can get that it is 100% vegetable and triple milk soap. I got a bloom in right here. So it has a little bit of bloom water in there. So I'll be going with that today. And <clears throat> the brush is a new brush I received. I had it soaked in here. I'll show you right here real quick. Is my new, let's see if I can focus here. The Chubby One uh, Super Badger. See, it's not focusing, is it? Let's see. There it goes. Right there. Little, little guy. Um, compared to, let's see, we'll go with my fader. Little, little dude. So, I did a test lather, test lather with it yesterday. Uh, performs really well. So, we're going to go with that today. The razor of choice will be, will be the uh, Parker variant. And a new uh, Gillette Nasset. So we're going to go with that today. Hope everybody's doing well. Having a good week so far. Getting close to the weekend. Almost cut myself. Beautiful. Uh, good start. Alright. <clears throat> we'll get this loaded up. Uh, try to catch up on videos. Uh, I see Nomeo. He's doing a... Uh, he's done <clears throat> a couple dedication videos. One to the Iceman, who is, for those of you who do not know, but most of you probably do, uh, Carl Kiefer, and uh, Frank the Shark Stromberg. <clears throat> Excellent videos. Awesome videos. Let's get this loaded here. Alright, so I'm going to kind of do this. Let's see here. Let's see. I'm going to go with, we'll go with a four. We'll go setting number four on the Parker variant. Let's see if you can catch that. Of course not, huh? Nope. There he goes. Four. Right there. There we go. <clears throat> setting number four. <clears throat> yeah, so No Meal, he did a couple of videos, awesome videos. Um, in regards to the uh, the shaving soaps that he received from Frank and uh, Carl, which I also received um, from them guys, I have not yet used them yet, but uh, we'll do so pretty soon. So, <clears throat> from the looks of it, both of them performed very very well. I'm kind of hesitant to use them because they're kind of un unobtainable here in the states. So yeah, kind of yeah. I'm kind of one of those. I don't want to. Kind of guys. So. Alright. <clears throat> with that said, let's get on with the shave, shall we? Alright, let's put the bloom water on the face. Um, the scent on this is... It says... Flying Mango. It has a small... It's kind of a... I don't know how to describe it. Because I'm not good with scents. Um, there's a... I get, I get a hint, a hint of mango, but more of a cologne, cologne, is that, is that a word? A cologne type scent, I guess. I, it's hard for me to describe. I guess it was, you could get a mango scented cologne. I guess. I don't know. But that's what I get out of it. So. I 
I caught uh, um, Manny from SoCal Shave. His uh, unboxing and a shave with Prohibition style soaps. I'm glad he likes those soaps because Justin makes some phenomenal products. Um, I'm a big fan of Justin's uh, products and soaps. Um, if you have not tried them, um, I believe Manny will concur that his products are very, very good. I believe he only has one soap, but he has a couple. Uh, he has a couple uh, samples. So, but I think he really likes that. Uh, the Lexus products. All right. So as you can see, I use some of the bloom water. It's a triple mill soap. It's kind of hard, but I bloomed it to, uh, to soften up the top layer. So here we go. Straight to the straight to the tub. Puck. I'm not like a reviewer of soaps. Um, I just use them, like I said in my previous videos. Because it's all subjective. I mean, you know, you give your opinion on what you like or what works for you or stuff like that. But, all right, we'll go with that. So my new little <clears throat> Simpson brush, my second Simpson brush I had. The other one I kind of traded away to some youngster named Spencer. So, all right, here we go, straight to the face. I really dig this little brush. It's kind of cool. So, if you belong to our, uh, there's a Facebook group called It's Just Shaving. Awesome freaking group. It's, it's, it's a cool little group. Um. They're doing a week-long Chevette shave kind of... They say it's a tutorial. Um, there's a few of us who got volunteered. I got volunteered. I don't see how I got volunteered. Because I, I, I don't... I mean, I have like the least amount of experience using a Chevette. But I was asked, well, actually, I was volunteered um, to do one. But anyways, with that said, um, there's a, a few guys uh, that have done them. Look, I'm dumbing you up. I forget what the hell I'm saying. Um, who have done already done their videos. They're uh, posted up on it's uh, It Shaving the Facebook group it's just shaving Facebook group um, so if you get a chance check it out there's a uh, good information on Chevette shaves and stuff like that I don't know how like I said how I got caught up in this because I have only started using a Chevette probably uh, a few months ago um, and I'm still learning so I don't know what the hell I could contribute other than probably what not to do, like by cutting the hell out of myself. So we'll see how that goes. I'm supposed to do it Saturday, I think. So see how that goes. So far the soap is phenomenal. Like I said, the scent the scent on this is it's not strong. It's mild. So We'll see how it goes. <clears throat> the mild scent, probably on a scale of one to ten, probably a three. <clears throat> kind of a cologne scent. All right, first pass with the growth. All 
around. So far, so good. I'm liking it. So far. In the stash area. Out the hand. It's weird looking into the camera and trying to do a shave. It's like delayed. I feel the, but it's like a half a second or so. Not a half a second, but it's like delayed and it's weird. I'm like down here and I'm, yeah, it's kind of scary. So, yeah. Pretty good first pass. The slickness? Mm, I don't know. Okay, yeah. It's there. It just doesn't, I don't know, on the face feel after. It's there though, it is. It's there. All right. First pass, pretty good pass. All right. <clears throat> All right. Second pass. I would have to say I like this little freaking brush. It's tiny as I'll get out, but I like it. Very soft. Holds lather well. Being a tiny brush, it's cool. Yeah, cool little brush. I like it. Can't complain with the lather. Very good. All right, let's uh, tone this down a bit here. Let's go let's see one or so. Four, we'll go to two and a half. See if you can see that. Probably not, huh? There you go. It's about two and a half right there, the little line. Two and a half. Yeah, we'll go with that. Cross screw. So, for those of you who watch my videos and stuff and actually subscribe to my videos, what other hobbies do you guys partake in? Um, Besides shaving or, you know, anything outside of work, besides shaving, you know, like bowling, golf, softball, you know, I know a bunch of, I know a couple of my coworkers who actually don't, they don't do videos and stuff, but they actually play like on a, 
on softball teams and stuff like that. Me, I play in a pool league. That's what I do. You know, I like the I like the sport. I've tried golf. Nope. Maybe if I got lessons, I'll probably like it more. I'm tired of paying for golf balls. Try bowling. Bowling's fun. Can't bowl with the crowd, but it's fun. So far, a phenomenal shave. Forget this razor, an excellent little razor. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. What do we got here? 16 minutes. Wow, don't talk though, just gonna screw stuff up. And for those of you who, uh, who are D shavers, which most of you probably are, and are interested in moving on to uh, Chevette shaves. Frank Stromberg, he, he posted a video on, because we're doing the tutorial thing. He posted a video uh, a couple days ago on the Chevette. If you guys haven't seen it, um, he posted it on the It's Just Shaving Facebook group. We'll go right over here. Um, check it out. I mean, very, very, very informative. Um, yeah, if you guys are interested in starting out with the Chevette, check it out. It's 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 awesome. Yeah, it's it's very informative. Um, for those of you who are interested in trying out a Chevette. Um, Pretty much what I've learned is from watching these guys, all the guys who are doing these tutorials, I'm the rookie of the bunch. I mean, I, you know, I know very little when it comes to Chevette's, um, but what I've learned so far is from watching all these gentlemen, so <clears throat> give it a look. Let's tone this down again. We'll go to, let's just go to a two, a half a notch low. We'll go to a two. Let's see if I'm going to focus there. Really. We'll focus. There we go, two. Guess the growth. Because I was watching uh, Frank's tutorial on his on the Chevette, and there's a technique that he uses <clears throat> when he gets when he uh, does his jawline, which is actually pretty good. I've never actually thought about doing it that way. Oh, look at that sheen on that. Well, oh, you can't see it, huh? Oh, you barely. And uh, I've never thought about doing it that way. 
what he does is, um, let me show you real quick. Get him off track here, but he takes his, his Chevette. I got a blade in there, be careful. And he, he goes cross, how does he do it? He goes cross grain, this way I believe it was, this way, and then this way. And I've always tried to do it kind of like with my dominant hand, or the same hand, is go this way, and then with the same hand again on the same side is this way. But he does it this way, and then this way. I'm gonna have to try that one of these days. Cause it seems, I don't know, it just, I don't know. Maybe it'll work for me, maybe it won't. I don't know, I've never tried it. But I'm gonna give it a shot and see what happens. Because I have issues with the jawline, with the Chevette. Because the way my hair grows, it grows out, kind of like Wolverine status this way. And it's kind of hard to get it smooth. So far, pretty good shape. Compared, com, compared, compared to my last, my last shave, which was my head shave, it was just all bad. Wow. A little bit on the neck, but overall, pretty, pretty good. Let's touch up the neck line a little bit. And we'll call that Benito. Flash Boredom, he's putting out videos again. He just put out a, another one. I guess he used a Williams mug soap. I didn't see it yet, but I got a notification. And Jim from uh, Jim Co. Shaves. Or Jim Co. Shaving? I forget. But anyways, he did one with uh, Uncle John's, the uh, group soap for It's Just Shaving. The... Uh, it's just cake. Which also I have. Haven't used it yet either.
Phenomenal shape. Fantabulistic. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good shave. Awesome shave. Oh, yeah. Half hour again. I was like, what the heck, man? Wait, 15 minutes. A while ago. Mm, a little bit better. Good shape. Excellent shape. A little bit of blood. Nothing like my head shape, though. That's for sure. I know there were some people saying, oh, how come you use your Allen block on your head? <sighs> yeah, I don't think so. Pass out, dog. Where's my Allen block? I'll use it today, though. There we go. Chicken wing, baby. Allen. Water. Here we go. little bit there but nothing there nothing there a little bit on the neck not bad set off let that dry out a little bit let this dry for a second rinse off the brush and then we shall recap and call that a day Shake. Awesome little freaking brush, man. I really did this thing. All right, a little bit of leakage there. Nothing too significant. Alright. A little bit <clears throat> died. Okay, so here we go. Recap. Soap was <clears throat> and throw some fingers. <laughs> went with peach there's peach okay so soap was <clears throat> asylum soap asylum shave works shaving soap flying mango uh, um, made in Italy made in Italy by Saponificio Vericino right here you see that right up there right there it's a 100% uh, vegetable and triple milk soap. Excellent soap. Performed very, very well. I like it. Awesome. The brush was <clears throat> my Simpsons Chubby One Super Badger. Awesome little brush. I really, really like it. We went with 
<clears throat> the Parker variant. Awesome razor with a brand new Gillette Nasset blade. <clears throat> razor Rock Alum. Still bleeding. No, it's okay. Call that good. One with Thayer's. And then I will use for the post shave balm the Aqua Velva 501 sensitive. Hit my head. Good job. Got extra? Put it on the dome. Alrighty. Excellent shave. Fantastic. With that said, we were all done. Well, I'm done. So, guys, uh, take care. Until the next time, um, check out Frank Stromberg. Check out his shave it video. Did an awesome job. Awesome? Awesome job. Um, well, that's it, guys. Take care. God bless. And we'll catch you guys on the next shave. Hopefully, we'll be maybe Saturday. The shave it. We'll see how that goes. I can't even use a DE right now. So, wish me luck. Take care. God bless. Talk to you guys later.